Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to change the Firefox background color. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is select the menu icon up at the top right corner of the Firefox browser. Just go ahead and left click on that. And then go ahead and select settings. On the right side, scroll down underneath language and appearance. And then under colors, Override Firefox default colors for text, website backgrounds, and links. Select Manage Colors. Now, just be cautious of what you're modifying in here because you can get some really crazy looking colors, themes in here. I'm going to go ahead and actually uncheck Use System Colors. And where it says Override the color specified by the page for your selections above. Click on the drop down here. Select Always. And now you can adjust the text and background. So basically the background is the white background with the text color on top of it. You can also modify the link colors as well. So for unvisited and visited links, we'll have different colors in here. So for the background, for example, if I were to double click on that, I can select a different basic color in here, or I can enter in an RGB code as well over here on the right. And then you can select add to custom colors or you can select one of the colors over here on the left side and then just select OK. And then you would select OK to save that. And you can see like what I'm saying, you just want to be mindful of what you're selecting here. I'm going to go back underneath Manage Colors. I'm going to change the background color back to white. So then if you want to change your back, I recommend checkmarking Use System Colors and then for the override color specified by the page for your selections above select only with high contrast themes or never perhaps either one or the other and then select OK and that should just revert it back to what it was. So pretty straightforward process guys. Do a buzz will help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.